face test time. We're all wearing neutrals though, I love it. Let's welcome Alex Earl. We're in LA. I am so excited for this trip, guys, because it is my first brand trip ever. It's gonna be an insane vlog, so just get ready. Um, but we just arrived at LAX. We got a rental car because Ryan just wanted a rental car, and I think it was like probably a very smart idea. Yeah. So, yeah, it's nice to have. Very smart on your part to get a rental car. First thing we have planned is our reservation at Elefante. We went there like two years ago and oh my god, it was so good. We dream about their whipped eggplant. So we're gonna go get some. And then after that, we're gonna check into the most iconic Beverly Hills Hotel. So I can't wait. I can't even believe it's happening. We were leaving our apartment this morning and I kind of started to tear up. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, do you have espresso, like for your espresso martini? I just want that. They brought out an espresso martini, and I was like, all right, well, let's get the night started, I guess. Okay, we're gonna head back to our car. Oh my gosh, everything is just so colorful. So blue, so green. Oh yeah, Ryan's colorblind. No, I'm Poor saying, like, in Austin, everything's like gray or like oh, brown, hush. you know? He's it a is. hater, guys. He's a hater. Guys, we're pulling up on the Playboy Mansion. Dang it! You can't see anything, but on a map it says it's right there. I am getting so nervous. I have the butterflies. Now I'm I don't think I can feel my feet. I'm getting numb. My whole body's numb because I'm so nervous. I have butterflies. <laughs> I'm scared, but excited. We're about to turn in. It's so beautiful out here. Look at the, like, even the bushes and everything. Yeah, everything's just so well cut. Well kept and beautiful. Your destination is on the line. Welcome to the Beverly Hills Hotel. We are here with Amazon and I wanted to give you guys a quick little room tour. So in here is the bathroom. It's so spacious, very classic. I think this is a TV over here but I can't figure out how to turn it on. We have a bathtub and a shower, of course. I'm curious to see what products these are. You have Paul Mitchell in there? Yeah, I do have Paul Mitchell in there. I'm not really sure, oh wait, the brand's here. Hmm. It has your own logos on it. Oh, ooh, very cool. Okay, so that's the bathroom. Oh, look, this is. There we go. We'll try later. Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> right, Look how so. big this closet is. For... Oh, yeah. Do you see it in there? It's Look bigger at those than my closet robes. We have to put on those robes. That's going to be so fun. Okay. Over here is the living area, the office. Ryan's definitely going to use this desk because he still has to 
work while I'm in events. Actually, the time zones are so off that I feel like you're going to be done when I'm in the events. Be done like, like noon every day almost. That's nice. We have some sweet treats. Some mini sweet treats. And this nice little sitting area. Amazon decks the room out. We have some Paul Mitchell. We have Sol de Janeiro. We have Splenda. We have Laneige. Ooh, I've heard of this. And this one. Um, just don't know how to pronounce those names, but <laughs> <laughs> over here is obviously the bed. Wait, babe, look at this. That is so cool. Yes, that is boss. so freaking cool. Wow. I don't know if you guys can see. Yeah. Iconic. We also have the garden view. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. This is the junior suite with garden view. He said it's nice and quiet. Look at all the beautiful greenery. Palm trees. I always think these palm trees are like truffula trees because they're just so long and like Harry, <laughs> yeah, from the Lorax, but it's so nice. I kind of want to explore, but I want to redo my makeup, get ready, and then we can explore. And mm -hmm. then you can drop me off at dinner or something. Yeah. Here's the first outfit of the brand trip. We have this dress. I'm renting it from Rent the Runway. Heels are Amazon. Bag is Amazon. Earrings. I love these earrings. I just got them in from Amazon. And I did a slip by pony, guys. I can't breathe. <laughs> like, Are you nervous or what? I'm so nervous. I don't know. <laughs> You want a beta blocker? <laughs> like, I feel like I'm gonna start shaking in a second. I think I just haven't really drank in enough water today. It probably was not smart. Um, but I feel like after this event, I'll at least know, like, hopefully a couple girls, so, like, it won't be as intimidating tomorrow. Oh my god, I just need to breathe. <laughs> I see so many cool people here. There's Mariana Hewitt. There's like Whitney Port. I'm literally gonna ship with you over. Hi vlog. It's can we Star. can we just take a minute for the eyes? The eyes. Oh my god. Hi. Chance to network and build community to educate you about the program, inspire you with product, and spend time with you in person, which we don't get to do enough. So this is our favorite part of the job. Good morning, it's day two. We just got some room service and a big reveal. Eggs Benedict and buttermilk pancakes. It looks delicious. I feel like I'm going to a work conference in this blazer. But we're gonna explore because Ryan has a little break in between his calls and we wanna like see the hotel in the daytime. So I have to vlog on my iPhone though because they are really like strict about like filming with like a big camera in this hotel, which Maybe is sad. Film probably would be fine, yeah, but I feel like the iPhone will get a better angle, so I'll just do the iPhone. We were going to do some exploring and maybe go to Air One, but we had room service. I'm not super hungry, and maybe we could just do it tomorrow. I'm so happy the weather is getting better. Blue skies are out, and I think I have like an hour until my next event or like my first panel of the day, and I wanted to give you guys a little recap of yesterday because I don't think I've done that yet. You guys probably saw I was barely breathing. I was so freaking nervous, but then... I went into the lobby, mingled with some girls, and I was totally fine after that. And the venue was like so cool. It was like this long table dinner party vibes, my favorite thing. I have so many TikToks of like cute little dinner parties saved on my uh, little TikTok. <laughs> it was truly unreal. And I met Jasmine Tooks, which is like my favorite Victoria's Secret model. She is stunning. And like I have so many of her makeup photos saved as inspo and her skin is just like flawless. Mariana Hewitt was there from Summer Fridays. Whitney Port was there from Laguna Beach. And so many, oh, Alex Earl was there. 
that octopus guy on TikTok. I don't even know his TikTok name, but I've seen him pop up on my For You page. He's currently getting really big, I feel like. Um, but it was just like so crazy to be in the same room as them. Um, so I don't know. I still can't wrap my head around it. I think today we have two panels and then one event at night. And I think the one at night is going to end at like 8.30. So I told Ryan we should like probably make a reservation for dinner somewhere because I think they said that they would have light bites. I'm also trying to hydrate a lot because I feel like yesterday I was getting a little bit of a headache because I was not drinking enough water. Also, I woke up this morning with my whole forehead like so sore. And I was asking Ryan, I was like, what the heck? Like, is this like a dehydration headache? And I was like, wait, why would this part actually be like sore? And then we concluded that it was because I was banging my head against the seat in front of me on the airplane. Like I, I was in the middle seat and basically that was how I was sleeping the whole entire time with my face and my hands and my head against the seat in front of me. So I guess it was just like going like that. <laughs> so um, lovely, lovely feeling. I also lost one of my gel nails. Like I forgot to use primer. So it just like slid off and I only realized it last night. I was looking everywhere in the bathroom. I couldn't find it. And because I had nail glue, I could just glue it back on. But this morning I just found it in my purse. So haha, we are good to go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at the blue skies. It's just so pretty. It also, warmer in the video, doesn't it? yeah, it definitely <laughs> looks warmer. It's kind of chilly, but these are my favorite flowers. And I, I mean, like, there's sometimes we can see them in Austin, but they're just like all over California. They're just like vines across like houses with flowers. And I was telling Ryan, like, all these houses have like really nice vegetation, but Austin couldn't do that because it has like freezes randomly. So, look how freaking stunning. Oh. Um. I gotta bring that heavy, Mary Poppins bag. <laughs> okay, we are here, and I just met an Austin content creator. I know, what are the actual chances <laughs> that That's so fun. I'm from Austin. I'm from Austin. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, great. what? <laughs> um, so we are just waiting to check in for our first event. Did you go to your first event? Mm -hmm. okay, so I guess <laughs> this is our first event, um, and it's with... Is this Alex or one? No, no, I think that's the next one. Okay. <laughs> Well, we'll find out what this is <laughs> and we'll update you guys. Apparently the event is outside, so Cindy got her little blanket. <laughs> and I summer yes. <laughs> Hi girl. Hi. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Reeboks over here, and I guess we get to pick some sneakers. So fun. And if not, we'll try them on quick. We got our nice little poof over here. So perfect. Let me know I can grab some sizes for you. I'm a size eight. Eight. Okay. Yes. And I'm a nine. Okay. And I'm here to welcome you to our spring trend report. Couldn't do it without a little help from one of our absolutely favorite influencers. So please welcome the one and only Rocky Bond. Let's start with fashion, right? We are just on that topic. Mm. Straight, straight into it. All right, so I'm going to be really creative and unique and tell you guys that florals are in for spring. <laughs> I'm sure no one thought about that. Ryan and I pulled on the side of the street because I really want to take some pictures of these cool prom trees. And he's looking on Zillow at these houses. The cheapest one I see is four beds, okay. four bedroom. 6.5 million. Holy shit. This one's 12 million. It's six bad. Here's 30 million. 30 million? Yeah, Wait, geez. look at that. Look at that. Look at the photos for the 30 million one. Damn. You an extra 30. Oh, here's 30. Uh, 6.65 million. Oh my god. Look at this view though from downtown. <laughs> I want to go. <laughs> wow. 
how big that is. Yeah. Like, who lives there? What kind of Us. people live there? Okay, yeah. We love that energy. Keep it up. Okay, I'm gonna go film a TikTok and take pics. We're pulling up on Rodeo. It already looks so bougie. It is time. We're going to... Nowhere. Airwalk. First we got the Hailey Bieber smoothie. I haven't tried it yet. Gonna do a taste test soon. And then I wanted an Olipop for later. Citrus, so good, the best flavor. Then, oh shoot. Did you spill it? <laughs> yeah, it got all messed up, but the tuna crispy rices and then the sushi sandwich. We wanted to try them both because like we don't have an air one, you know, might as well get it all. And then we also got some spring water and some wasabi most important part. Um, and also Ryan got a coffee. How's your coffee? It's yeah. really good. I did it in the one this morning. That's good. This morning wasn't very good. <laughs> Taste test time. Let's see. Got a lot of the strawberry. Get more. Oh, that was good. Yeah, Ooh. Good at all. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That kind of tastes like strawberry ice cream or something. Better than yesterday's tartare, I think. Yeah. We had tartare at tuna tartare at Elefante, and it was like very bland. But this is like good. It has like sauce. It's kind of cold, but I feel like it usually doesn't really come like hot. So, what's our rating for this? 7.5. So, oh, literally, I was going to say 7.5. <laughs> Cheers. I think I like this better. Mm. Only, yeah, because there's, yeah, there's salmon in it. Salmon? I think. It's still pretty good. What all I got at the first event of the day. So we got two pairs of Reeboks. What do you think? These are cool. Don't you have those? I don't have these. <clears throat> you have some similar, I thought. Yeah. I mean, I have Reeboks, but they're more like New Balance style, I yeah. feel like. And then these ones. Cool. These colorful ones. In this bag, we have a whole bunch of products. I have no idea how to say this brand, so Sulawasu, there we go, gentle cleansing foam. We have the renewing cream, <clears throat> ooh, fun, new nails, ooh, we got Alex Earl's Amino Lean, I don't, I don't, wait, what is this, what is this? Amino acid? <laughs> Just energy? I'm like, I don't really do pre-workout. Is that pre-workout? No, amino acids help just like build your muscles and repair them. Oh. Cool. Oh, Laneige Water Bank. Sula, Sula, Su. Oh, Renewing Serum. Innisfree <laughs> Hyaluronic Acid Serum. Um, I just am not gonna say the brand <laughs> name <laughs> anymore. Activating Serum. Um, this one's Dewy Glow Jelly Cream. Guys, how am I gonna take- oh, hell yeah. We got a Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. How am I gonna take this all home? Splenda. Nice. <laughs> a cute little hat, palm tree hat. Splenda Monk Fruit. Paul Mitchell Shampoo- <gasps> yes! Paul Mitchell Shampoo and we got the Brazilian Bum Bum Sprays. Which one did I use in the shower? I need to smell them all. But whatever I used over there, it smells amazing and I'm hoping one of these are the set. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's what was in my goodie bag. And now I'm gonna get dressed for a panel and then the Sunset Soiree. So the panel, we have Alex Earl and Girl Boss Town on that. And then the Sunset Soiree is hosted by Charlie D'Amelio. And I just saw Helen Owen, Alyssa Lynch, and Sammy Clark. Sammy Clark like does the form app, like she's a fitness girl, and I did form for a while, so that was literally wild. Did she just like walk past us and I was like, <gasps> like I froze up, and I just like tried not to stare, but I was like, oh my god, that's really them. So that was really cool. I also still need to steam my outfit. 
for tonight, so let's go do that. Day two, what event is this? Like, I don't even know. I know. We're all wearing neutrals, though, I love it. Yeah, I know, we're matching each other's Oh, I think I'm not taking it off. Oh. Oh, energy drinks. That's probably very needed. I know. Hello. I think I need that. I know, right? Yeah, that's okay. So we had a big one. Hey, everyone. And then next up, let's go ahead and welcome some ladies that you may recognize. First up is Robin Del Monte of Girl Boss Town. And let's welcome Alex Earl. Thank you so much more than just another face with another TikTok audio. So I think using my voice um, was super important for gaining that audience on TikTok and that's kind of how it all got started. And when I say consistent, by the way, I don't necessarily mean just in terms of like posting cadence. I mean, maybe when you're posting content, are you in the same bedroom with the clothes in the background, right? Are you, essentially you want your viewers to see you as their friend. And so you want to do things in a, a very consistent way, how you uh, address your audience too, right? Is there a certain like phrase, you know, it comes to mind, uh, you know, off the top of my head, Rocky Barnes, who's a fantastic influencer, she always says, time to get dressed. And just like by way of knowing that, I am a part of her community. We're wrapping things up for our spring's favorite event, but we have a sunset soiree we want you to join us with. Uh, so definitely grab some food, some drinks. early from the party because my toes were about to fall off like they were so frozen but Ryan and I are gonna go to Dobrik's and see what it's all about. How far is it? Did you look it up? A mile and a half. Nice. Before. Hopefully there's not like a long line because I'm really hungry and I have a bit of a headache. I just took some headache medicine so hopefully it won't be horrible but let's take that water. I'm also feeling like I'm not drinking enough water so Air One water is coming with us. I didn't realize it was carbonated when I bought it, but it's okay. We're pulling up on the Oppenheim group. If you guys watch Selling Sunset on uh, I Netflix. <laughs> I recognize the FP Jordan store. I was taking a video to my friend. I turned the camera by accident and saw Oppenheim. I was like, oh, <laughs> was like we had that too. Here it is. The Oppenheim group. Wow. Oh, someone's in there. <laughs> Real estate agents. <laughs> <laughs> this is a really cool street, Sunset Boulevard. Probably been here before, but I just don't remember. Yeah. Right, we're pulling up. It's parking. No bricks. We're gonna manifest some parking. We got this. We found parking, guys. Don't ever doubt me. Not that I was parking, but you know, I manifested for us. Good morning. It is day three or four, or I don't know. It's our last day here. I'm sad. We're gonna go get some breakfast. <laughs> Ryan. It's <laughs> <laughs> <He's> like showing me. <laughs> We're going to eat at Great White. It's actually been saved on my Instagram for a while now, so I'm excited to go. And it looked really good. Sydney just posted about it yesterday. I think she went yesterday for breakfast, so let's go. I've heard of this place called Gracias Madre. It's right there. I just can't get over all these palm trees and the blue skies. The air is so clean when it rains. Yeah. But it doesn't rain often. This restaurant is so 
such a vibe and I can't believe like we're still alive because it's 8, 8.45, but it is 10 back in Austin. And I just got a matcha, Ryan, how was your coffee? It's good to have honey in it. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Yeah, I like honey in my matcha. I haven't had a matcha in so long though. I feel like it makes me a little anxious sometimes, so I feel like I shouldn't drink a lot before I eat. It's a vibe in here, isn't it? Yeah. We might have to go to another coffee shop probably once you get pretty bit. Yeah, we have to check out at 12. At least it's not like 10 though. done with breakfast and I think we're gonna drive around a bit because Ryan only has to be back in like an hour or so for a call and yeah Beverly Hills is just so nice like this whole area is so pretty we just packed up the whole room in 20 minutes because we were like oh my gosh we have to get out um, but we did get like a later checkout. It was at 12, so that was really nice. But my event starts at 1, so I don't know what we're gonna do. I'm <laughs> just like hanging out here, or, like drive around. I'm not really sure. We're just gonna pack up the car, and yeah, I'm really sad to leave because this hotel is like number one iconic and so homey. You know, like I feel like every other hotel I've just been like, okay, I'm ready to go home, but now I'm like, wait, I could totally live here. Like, took the amount of space we have, I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's a lot of space in here. Um, but I got all my goodie bags. Didn't leave anything. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna actually take it all back because my suitcases all feel really heavy now. But it's gonna be a good day. This is the outfit. I kept my hair straight because Ryan said he liked it. So I just did that. And I also didn't really have time to curl my hair. Shoes are Steve Madden. Jeans are Citizen of Humanity. Um, tank top, it's like racer tank top. It's from Meshki and then this is from Revolve. I think it's like Lovers and Friends. Just checked out of the Beverly Hills Hotel, but the Amazon events are not over yet. I have two more tonight and they started actually 1.30. So we have like an hour to kill. And last time I was in California, the one thing I wanted was salt and straw because I've heard of this ice cream for a while and I didn't realize it was in LA. And last time I didn't get the chance to come all the way out here um, from Irvine because like with traffic, it can be like an hour and a half sometimes. So we just stayed in Irvine last time but I was like, ooh, should we get ice cream? Cause like, I don't think I'm really hungry. Like breakfast was very filling. So mm. we are getting some salt and straw and finally trying it. I swear all my travel vlogs always turn into food vlogs. I can't even remember if I vlogged it or not cause I was doing a little TikTok, but I got honey lavender and the salt and malted chocolate chip cookie dough. And that one is the best and it's so freaking good. Like the chip, it's just very well cookie dough. You know what I mean? Like if you buy cookie dough ice cream at the grocery store, there's just never enough cookie dough in it. But this is like really good. Back at the hotel and it's raining outside so I think they're moving everything indoors. Right in here.
So that's a wrap on the Amazon Influencer Program Spring Favorites event. It was insane. Like, I don't think I'll ever get over this weekend, to be honest. The last two panels I went to was with one girl that I knew from actually like to know it for years. Like, I feel like her collages are everywhere. And she was so nice. Her name's Jen, and she's so insightful like so helpful she like stayed after and just gave us so many tips and i was like wow like you are so kind like so genuine and then of course we had a paris hilton um panel but unfortunately it got rained on like today wasn't even supposed to be the rainy day so that really sucked um because i think she probably would have talked for a lot longer if it wasn't raining then we got the paris Hilton memoir and like a cutting board. I'm like, I don't know if I can even take that home, but it's super cool and I don't read, but I might read this because I'm like, okay, now I kind of want to know her secrets. She was saying she like spilled some tea in here um, and I feel like bo a book about Paris is not going to be like super hard to read. So we'll, we'll check it out. We'll see. <laughs> um, but I told Ryan I was pooped. I'm so tired and it doesn't help that it's rainy even though there's like blue skies. It just sucks that it rained today, especially the last day. Um, but we are going to Chacha Matcha even though I had a matcha already, but that was like at 8 a.m. It's currently almost 5 p.m. Um, and I've been wanting to try the chai matcha. I watched this girl on YouTube. Her name's JC Marie. You probably know of her. Um, she's one of my favorite YouTubers and she's also on TikTok. But in her YouTube vlogs, when she comes to LA, she always gets like a matcha chai so or a chai matcha i'm not really sure if it's like on the menu or if she like just orders that um like a special menu item so we'll see if it's not on the menu maybe i'll just get like a chai because i already had a matcha today but i'm excited to check this chacha matcha out i had it in new york and it was pretty good i got like the lavender one but i want to try something different today so that is what we're doing and then at 7 30 we have a reservation for catch la i have heard so many things about it over the past years and so we're finally going they have like sushi steak like everything so i'm excited to eat some sushi tonight i don't know if i told you guys this yet but my grandma actually lives in irvine so i'm extending my trip i'm going to visit her and all of my other mom's side of the family so that's gonna be really fun um and we're actually leaving tonight right after our reservation and that's why i made our reservation kind of late so we could beat traffic and just like drive there um, in the evening because right now we looked it up and it's gonna take two hours and 20 minutes if we leave right now Which is insane because I don't think I think the last time we came and like took one hour and 15 minutes And that was like at like eight or nine or something. So I don't really think it even takes that long, but Hopefully we will not hit traffic on the way there. But if we do I guess that's just LA destination for our food tour of LA what well, has turned into a food tour and I think I said this before but we're going to catch And I know that's like actually mom in like 
you know, our language, but for some reason we all call my grandma Emma, so I don't even know how to explain it other than that. What rating do we give Catch? Solid 8.9. It was pretty good, guys. Like, it wasn't overhyped, and I was really, really worried about that because, you know, when you go to, like, restaurants, I mean, I guess this whole trip I've been going to restaurants that I've heard about on TikTok and stuff, but it was, pricey. It was definitely pricey, yeah. Definitely the most expensive, right? We've had. Oh, here? Yeah, here. But it was a good one. Went out with a bang in LA, and now we're in Irvine for the weekend until Sunday, um, and we're just going to have, like, a wholesome weekend. I don't really know what we're gonna do, but all I know is that I wanna go to Laguna Beach one day because we went there the last time he was here and we loved it. We just like love those little beachy areas. I mean, they're all so different. Santa Monica, Venice Beach, uh, Huntington Beach, Newport, Laguna. Did we see all of those beaches last time? You were here? Oh my God. We like went to all the, I don't think we went to Huntington when you were here last time. We went to Venice, yeah. Yeah, I didn't I'm gonna end this vlog here and start a new one, but I just wanted to say a big thank you to you guys and just anyone who supports me because it really, really, truly means so much to me. And if you guys don't already follow me on TikTok and Instagram and all the things and my Amazon storefront, I will have it linked down below. You can actually follow me on Amazon so you can be like updated of what I add to my storefront and all the things. So I'll see you guys on those platforms and in my next vlog. Bye.